I'm a local bartender, and this is my bar. The African whiskey. So we have the millet and sorghum and fruit wine from Uganda. We also sell the burukutu wine from Nigeria, but it's out of stock. I was born and raised in the bar. And alcohol was the family's source of livelihood. I've always cherished your alcohol to that of the neighbors because it's kind-hearted and sickly sweet. Your drinks have drained our wallets, so I'm not complaining. I had come to say hello to the famous wine girl that champions the sale of these drinks that have destroyed our marriages. He's dead. He's dead. Your client is okay, dead. Okay, calm down. We've got a little emergency in here that requires everyone to leave. My husband has been shot dead in a local band. I need your help immediately. <laughs> You have killed the father of my children. I'm not the one who killed you. Then who did? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? You're going to pay a huge price for his death. And this bar is going underground with him. I'm officially starting an investigation into the death of Mr. Kasozi. That was murdered on the 14th of June in this bar. When they be gele food wine, so me no bother with it. When they be gele food wine, say na na. When they be gele food wine, I'm a man go meet a mother. When they be gele food wine, say na na na. When they be gele food wine, but in your ass. When they be gele food wine, don't dream me now. When they be gele 